It's Thomas Jefferson. It's where he's buried. He's inside the water. Get him out. Kidding. Here we are. Dude, you're late. supposed to tell me to go do something. Uh. Of course, son. What's on your mind? What am I supposed to be doing? Escort the scientists inside Project Purity. Oh, okay. Are you in? Are you in? Expect her to be in. Here we are. Okay. I hate you. Fucking dad. Fucking always ruining my fun. Just be careful what you touch it. What's your story? I've been with Dr. Lee for about ten years now. She needed an assistant, and I needed something to do. It was either this or wind up dead in a ditch someplace, you know? <laughs> it's funny. There's no response. Here we are. Dude. What do we need to do right now? The project was abandoned shortly after we were born. Things have deteriorated here since then. And there's been some flooding. I need you to get to the flood control pumps and activate them so we can clear out the water and reach the mainframe. Okay, where did we go? The automatic doors sealed when the flooding occurred. So you'll have to use the access tunnels to reach the pumps. Okay. So we have to go to the control pump for the pump pump of the pump flow of the pumps and the pumps of the flows pumps. Yeah, that place. You know the one. We actually walked by it when we were down here killing mutants, and I actually looked over at it, and I was like, mm, no. So then the intercom, where I stopped and looked at the intercom, and I was like, can I use that yet? That's where it is. And I was looking at the switch, and I was like, huh. It's like, I'm going to have to come back here, I know it. It just it didn't click, man, it didn't click. Okay, sorry about that, once again. So now I have to go back. Lovely. If we crash again, I'm going to be so pissed that rockets are going to shoot out my butt. What the hell happened there? Damn. Okay, let's go back. Apparently we need fuses. Now, what were... Why and how I knew I needed fuses, or... How my dad thinks he'd just tell me I need fuses is beyond me, but... You know, it, they... Did. Never mind. He probably knows what he's doing. Jeez, he's Liam Neeson, for God's sake. I've been hearing good things about you. Is it true? Did you really disarm the bomb and Megaton? It's funny, because if you do more negative parts of side quests, you actually get him, and he's like, I need to talk to you about some things. You fucked up. Uh, yes, I disarmed the bomb. I'm very proud of you, even though you put yourself in harm's way. Just... Please, be careful out there. This is a dangerous world. Far more dangerous than anyone on that vault knows. Okay. Oh, wait. I know there's a lot going on. I just wanted to say... I wanted to say that I'm proud of you. You're a good person, and it shows. Thanks, Dad. Well, you tell me everything you know. As much as I'd like to, I can't take all the credit. You're the one making the choices. I'm glad to see they've been good ones. Overall. Very proud. Not all Look of them again. Getting all sentimental. There's time for that when our work is done. Uh, he said something about fuses. Right. The flooding shorted out some of the fuse boxes downstairs, including one that controls some of the automatic doors. Here, take these fuses. The box is back down in the sub-basement near the eastern end of the level. Once the fuses are replaced, you'll be able to get to the mainframe. Okay. So that's why we need the fuses. 
Sorry, I was being stupid earlier, which seems to be a norm on here. So now we go back. It's a fetch quest. We're going back and forth. It's a fetch quest. What do you expect? It's a fetch quest. We might crash. It's a bad computer. No, it's not. It's actually a really good computer, but for some odd reason, I don't know. But my... But my computer just doesn't like the mods that I'm running. So it crashes every once in a while when I'm in tight confined indoor spaces kind of like in real life except I'm not claustrophobic but maybe I should be it would be more comfortable not to go in houses when I'm playing Fallout 3 he but then again that would be pretty stupid who would want to be that kind of person I know I wouldn't what about you I just went in a circle, let's do it again, because it's a circle, yeah. Okay, so, big surprise, it... Let's so say, big fucking surprise that my computer crashes right when I get to the fuses. Right when I actually find them, and not pass them up the one time. Anyways, now we go to the main frame, which is that big super metal door that we passed up because it wouldn't open. But now the light that was red next to it is now green, so we're going to use it. Main frame. Aw, oh, yeah. Before we do that, I'm going to start saving again. Seems to be something that's smart in us. Jana says there's a blockage in one of the intake pipes. It's on your way back. Head back up to the museum level and give me a call on the intercom when you get there. All right. Drain the intake pipes. Not doing that again. <laughs> uh, the stupid things I come up with when I'm LPing. I swear. I don't know why I'm in a very not LP commentary mood, but I am in a commentary kind of mood. So this is probably very terrible commentary, but it uh, it works, I guess. I'm not talking about the game as much as I would like to be. But then again, I don't know. It's hard to decipher whether or not you want to be the type of LP -er who talks about... Okay, so you thought the last area was bad. Well, how do you think my computer's going to react down here? Anyways, okay, seriously... How fucking bad is this? I'm a, this close. You can't see it, but I'm this close to turning off these mods and making things look terrible again. Thank God this is outside. And lo and behold, we did it. The hell? Uh-oh. It's the Enclave. Alright, let's get out of here. Son of a bitch. Run before the computer crashes. Broken toilet with a plunger. Someone had a really bull... Someone laid a bull blaster. And we come out here. Another room that I crash in. Lovely. Well, now, your biggest worry is that you're going to have to be dealing with Enclave soldiers on your way back to Project Purity's control room. Good thing we got the fix right here. Actually, I might go with the last few bullets we have on Lincoln's repeater to take these guys out. Damn, I thought I was going to kill him. Oh, I sh shot his weapon out of his hand. That was epic. Plasma mines. I don't think we have any of those. Maybe we do. 
I'm not sure. Uh, we'll use the plasma rifle. Use our own shit against them. Why not? I mean, we're also going to be picking up ammo from them, so it's a win-win situation. And you actually don't fight that much of them, so... Don't get all giddy about it. Oh, and the, the one guy I come across using a Chinese assault rifle. Or the second guy I come across. And once again, I would be taking their armor. Oh, it's a laser rifle. I would be taking their armor, except for the whole, you know, can't use power armor yet. But we will be able to soon. Trust me. Back in Jefferson Rotunda. This facility is now under United States government control. The person in charge is to step forward immediately and turn over all materials related to this project. That's quite impossible. This is a private project. The Enclave has no authority here. I'm going to have to ask you to leave at once. Am I to assume, sir, that you are in charge? Yes, I'm responsible for this project. Then I repeat, sir, that you are hereby instructed to immediately hand over all materials related to the purifier. I'm sorry, but that's... Furthermore, you are to assist Enclave scientists in assuming control of the administration and operation of this facility at once. Colonel, is it Colonel? I'm sorry, but the facility is not operational. It never has been. I'm afraid you're wasting your time here. Sir, this is the last time I am going to repeat myself. Stand down at once and turn over control of this facility. Colonel, I assure you that this facility will not function. We have never been able to successfully replicate test results. I suggest you comply immediately, sir, in order to prevent any more incidents. Are we clear? Yes, Colonel. Now do whatever you want. There's no need for more violence. Then you will immediately hand over all materials related to this project aid us in making it operational at once. Very well. I need a few moments to bring the system online. Enough of these delays. Almost ready. I'm compiling the data now. Run. Run! Son of a bitch. James. He's gone. We have to get out of here. They'll be coming for us next. We've got to evacuate now. Just as long as we don't leave through somewhere where it might crash. What the hell just happened? James. Your father caused an overload. He sacrificed himself to keep the Enclave from getting the purifier. And to buy us some time to escape. There'll be more of them coming. We need to get out of here before they find us, or else your father died in vain. How do we lead the way? There's an old tunnel that will lead us out of here to someplace safe. We used it as an evacuation route once before, but that was a long time ago. I hope everyone remembers how to get there. There isn't time to round everyone up. Come on, follow me, and hurry! Shit. And he died. No, I'm just kidding. It's, uh, <laughs> well, he did, but, you know. Um, it's actually a really... What is going on up there? A lot of assholes just... went shit ape. We Don't wander off. We're going to need you. Excuse me? You heard me. We need you right now. You're the only one here with any amount of combat experience. We've got the Enclave behind us, and who knows what ahead of us. If we're going to make it through here, we need your help. You're right, what do you need me to do? We need to stick together, but we need to move quickly. We'll follow behind you, alright? Let's get moving. Let's go moving. Follow me. We'll be right behind you. Be careful. So, you don't have to keep all of these assholes alive, just Dr. Lee. But it helps if you keep all of them alive. Goo pile of radiation. Lovely. 
And you don't come across too much threats down here. I think it's literally just ghouls, mostly. You might come across a few Enclave soldiers. Thanks for the patriotic music, iBot, who's following us. There's a ton of iBots down here. Which is ironic, because those are the scouts for the bad guys. What do you mean, you, it'll, you can open it, but it'll take some time? I can open it, and it'll take like two seconds. Ow! <laughs> Shit. I bought in my face and it blew up. That was just lovely. It was just loveless. Jim West, Desperado. Anywho. Yeah, your dad dying. It's a super emotional moment, and I kind of just overlooked it. Sorry, I couldn't make that more emotional, but I've seen it like... 20 times? It's not that I suck. It's just that I reload at the worst times. Anyways, big surprise, crashed again. So, I'm going to save here, and this will be the end of our escapades for now. I'll see you guys next time. Thank you so much for watching. This has been your host, as always, William Neal. Bye-bye.